Hi, today we're going to be working on this. Uh, this is an Acer Travelmate 7520 laptop. Um, basically, if you plug in the charger, the battery light comes on orange showing that it's charging. But uh, when you press the power button, the little green light here flickers, goes off, and nothing else happens. It will not come on. Um, if the battery on the motherboard has run flat, it can cause an issue like that. And in this case, that's what the problem is. So I'm going to show you how to take this laptop apart, get the motherboard out, to show you how to replace the, the battery. Alright, so... You can start by taking off this cover here, the ones with the holes in it. So there's a few screws around and a few in the center. Remove your battery. Another cover here. This is for your second hard drive bay. Okay, remove the hard drive, you just put it back like that, put that in a safe place. Take out the screw here that holds in the, the DVD ROM, you'll be able to just slide it out. Okay. Remove all the other screws that you can see around the cover. There's quite a lot. Make sure that you get them all out. Don't leave any in. Okay, then we have to disconnect the Wi-Fi card. They got your Wi-Fi card. On the top of the keyboard you'll see four little tabs that you have to push in to release the keyboard. Pull back on the white connector to release the ribbon cable. Now that your keyboard's out, you have to remove the top cover here. So, um, it must come out this way. There are clips or tabs underneath here, but it must, it must be released like this. Okay, there's a ribbon cable which goes to the, the power switch here. So, you're going to need to... Just disconnect that, pull the tab backwards, pull out the cable. Okay, three tabs here on the motherboard that you must remove. Okay, um, you can now remove the screen. Okay, so signal cable. One other cable there and then these two cables which connect to your Wi-Fi. Alright, the screw on either corner. Okay. 
and you just lift it out of its socket. Okay, there's one more screw here. Okay, you can just peel this cable off its glue. You can leave it in the motherboard if you like. Okay, now we can separate the top cover from the bottom cover. Let's screw one more plug here going to the cutoff switch there. Okay, so Now we have the motherboard exposed and as you can see here is the the battery we need to replace. Okay, so just peel back the sticky tape there. This is um, a CR2032 button cell. Okay, uh, it should be reading 3 volts so you can take yours out and test it. Uh, Replace it with a new one and then we put it back together. Okay, so pop out the old battery. Pop in the new one. There you go. And recycle that. Okay, so now we're going to put it back together, just the opposite way that we took it apart. Okay, so um, before we put all the screws in, let's just turn it on and see if everything's working okay. There we go, comes on. So changing that battery did the trick. So. Um, if you're having a type of problem with your laptop, don't give up hope. There's always a fix. Thanks for watching.